What is up, YouTube? It's RS Mario here, bringing you another, well, probably the last, <laughs> hopefully, unless I, unless I catch something else in this video, the last uh, part of my big uh, Zelda Wii U gameplay analysis. Alright, so looking at this video a few more times, I realized there is something else in the background. You know, in the uh, the portion of the video right before he starts, well, when he starts talking about arrows, you know, before they, you know, clip to the, um, cut to the clip of them actually shooting uh, things with the arrows. There's actually a part where he's, like, near the end of the forest part where he whips out the bow. You can actually see in the background there's, like, a, uh, some sort of fortification. You know, it looks like a palisade wall from far away. Or it could be some sort of wall, like a broken wall. You know, maybe that's the dungeon. I don't think that's the dungeon that you actually get to. You know, well, that you, they, 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 that they allude to in the later footage, but I think it is possibly a dungeon, or maybe just another fortification. Maybe it's a maybe it's a small town or something. You know, that's kind of like something to break up the monotony of you know the empty space. You know, maybe it's a little settlement, like a little town or something. But it's definitely something wooden over there. You, know, you can definitely see it a little bit of it right here in this screenshot. Um, you know, you can see like through those trees that there's like a what could be like the, the main gate or maybe a guard tower of some sort. Uh, in this screenshot, you can see um, you know a little bit, a little bit something else like you know something else looking like a wooden wall. Um, you know, right there. So you know that's that's a couple things. You know, it could be anything. Uh, one part I was thinking it might be the um, the Gerudo Fort, but I'm like that's way way too much green <laughs> I mean it has to be you know on the border of the Guru Desert for the be the Guru Fort from Ocarina of Time that's not possible so this is probably something that they put into this game and there's probably like little forts or like say little towns like this if it's a fort it'll probably be like um like the uh like the, like you know how in Skyrim they have the uh the bandit encampments you know, you can kind of like, you know, you're just kind of like going along, you get jumped or they try to rob you. And eventually, you have to go in and like kill them all. Well, this will be something like that. You know, something like abandoned encampment. You know, or it could be a small town where you go here and you get supplies and weapons and arrows and things. And something like that. You know, nobody knows. You know, this could how this could tie into gameplay. You know, um, you know, but it's definitely something over there. That's probably one of the reasons why they kind of cut this, you know, short. I wouldn't be surprised if we don't see the that part of the gameplay later, and they just cut out the parts they wanted us to see at the video game awards, and then you know the other stuff they'll probably show later at the E3 or some sort of Nintendo Direct or something like that. Um, the other thing I really wanted to show you guys in this mount uh, in this uh, video is uh, what appears to be possibly Death Mountain. Now, I could be wrong, because it does seem very, it seems far away, but it also seems kind of close. You know, I mean, it, it, I mean, because, you know, if it's really that far away, it would be smaller. You know, but in the distance, you can see there's a mountain with some smoke coming out of it. You know, so, it looks like it could be Death Mountain. You know, it could be something else. It could be a completely new mountain altogether, but I doubt they'll make another volcano, seeing as though how iconic Death Mountain is. To the Zelda uh, franchise and the lore, I doubt they would just go, "Oh, let's make a new mountain and stick it over here." Like, no, I don't think they would do that. So it's possibly that that's Death Mountain, you know, in the distance. You know, um, uh, it's uh, you, there's a better picture of it here with him, like kind of behind some trees. But you can kind of see it looks like Death Mountain. Or it could be a mountain with a cloud over it. I could be wrong, but um. Yeah, it looks like it could be Death Mountain. And that does not look like too far of a trek, though. That's the only thing that's killing this for me, is that, um, you know, it doesn't look too far away. It looks reachable, you know, and it's not, you know, that far away. Or this could be the draw distance of the game just fooling me, you know. Um, but that's, uh, that's about it as far as much as I can glean out of this. I think I've squeezed every drop. Of information somebody else will probably get some more out of it but this is about as all I can see I've seen man I'm freaking <laughs> oh my gosh so many Zelda videos it's been like I don't think I've ever had this many Zelda videos in a week like this is what the first two it's been four videos this week 
Uh, I'm still kind of planning on doing a theoretical video on Saturday. Um, you know, like I always do. And it won't be about Zelda Wii Well, kind of won't be about Zelda Wii U. It'll be more of a theory, you know, about the theories and myths in the Zelda universe than specifically about Zelda Wii U. Um, you know, get back on track with my old content. You know, but this was, you know, of course, this is too big to pass up, you know. So, uh, that's about it for this video. Uh, like, comment, subscribe. You know, guys, you, you guys know what to do. Come on, you got y'all know. And, you know, I done told y'all this 130 some odd times. You know, like, comment, and subscribe. And, you know, you kind of do sometimes. So, you know, y'all guys know what to do. Um, keep it real. <laughs>